Hey Team Confident, I just wanted to share with you a couple things that I've been thinking about lately in um, my leadership and how I can be a better leader to you. And there's just um, a few quick things that I wanted to share. Um, so a lot of you don't know this and I hesitate to tell you this because I don't want to come off as bragging in any way. Um, but I think it's important for you to know this um, because if I can rock this unique business, you can too. I 100% believe that. So um, this month, I actually hit $40,000 in lifetime sales. So since November of 2014, when I joined Unique, I have sold $40,000 worth of makeup. Now that is crazy um, when I really consider how much makeup that is. Um, but I wanna share, the reason why I wanna share with you is because um, I just think that, like I said, if I can do it, anyone can do it. And so here's the thing is we've had a lot of new products come out. We have a ton of makeup products. And no matter where you are, um, or the reason why you join Unique, um, whether it was just for the kit or just to get a makeup discount or you just do it for fun or a hobby or you're really trying to make money off of this, like, like I am, that's why I joined. Um, no matter where you are, I believe that um, you can sell it. You can sell anything, okay? I am still selling mascara. Mascara is still the number one thing I sell the most of. I would love to be able to break down how much mascara I've actually sold from that um, 40,000. I'm not sure, but I know that in my even in my current parties, there are still women who have heard of the mascara and still haven't tried it and they want to buy it. So how am I able to sell it when I myself haven't used it, okay? I'm gonna tell you two things that I think are really important when you are selling, okay? So this is if you have every single product in every single color or if you only have your presenter's kit, all right? The first thing that I think is the most important when you are selling is to be confident in yourself. All right, so my confidence has totally grown, but it's not just about how I view myself. It's about um, being confident in your knowledge, being confident that you have the skills to sell the product, okay? So for example, I can't wear the mascara. I have used it on false lashes, but that's not really the same thing. I just do that as my application video, right? I have no eye pictures with me in the actual mascara on my actual lashes, yet I sell the most of it. And it's because I am genuine and I am confident that this product is amazing. I can tell you how to apply it. I can troubleshoot it. I can um, let you know what issues you know, you may experience with it, but I myself can't use it. So the reason I sell so much of it is because it, I'm confident in myself. There are other things that I don't use, products that I don't use, okay? Let's say, for example, the brow gel, the brow liner. I don't use those, okay? Um, what have I done to help myself be able to sell those? Well. One thing is I asked you all for your help, right? I um, went to the team and I went to others who have amazing brows from, from these products and I said, can I use your picture? Can I um, use what you're doing so that I can sell this product? And guess what? The answer is yes, the pictures work. Do I still sell brow products even though I don't use them? Absolutely, okay? Um, so, like I said, number one, I'm confident in myself. Number two, I am confident in the products themselves. I'm confident in our company. So, I can recommend products that I 
don't personally use because I know that our company is not going to put out anything that is not freaking amazing, all right? Um, there are some things that may not work personally for me that I'm not gonna use. Mascara, brow gel, um, cream ship foundation, the rose water I think maybe breaks me out, I'm not sure. But those are some things that I am not personally using. Can I still sell them? Is it being disingenuine to sell a product that you haven't personally used? I don't think so. I don't think so at all because I know I have confidence in Unique that they are making amazing products that women absolutely love. And there's people, not only on this team, but in our black upline under Cara, who are using a product that, guess what? They're gonna love it, okay? They're gonna use a lip color that I don't have yet. And I, if a customer wants that picture, wants a picture of someone wearing pretentious lipstick, I'm not gonna say, oh, I'm sorry, I can't help you. Um, you want hot pink? Oh, well, I'm sorry, I don't have a picture of myself in it. No, I'm gonna go to our team photos and I'm gonna find a picture of someone that I know and say, hey, this is my friend and this is her wearing the pretentious lipstick, okay? She loves it, if she loves it, and you're looking for a hot pink lipstick, I'm sure you would love it too, okay? So I'm confident that I can help my customers, confident in myself and confident in the products and in Unique, okay? So um, that's how I've been able to sell so much mascara. That's what it breaks down to. Um, also, time, okay? Yes, I do put time into my business. I didn't start Unique just because I was a stay-at-home mom looking for something to do. I truly got into Unique because I wanted to make money and I wanted to be more available to my kids. And I have been able to do that. But that doesn't mean that it comes easy. I'm asking people every single day. I'm following up with customers. I'm following up with people who told me they're going to order and they haven't yet to see if they have any questions. I'm asking people if they've ever thought about joining my team. I'm doing all of these things regularly, and I am a busy person. I don't want you guys to think for a second that all I do is unique. I have um, two other jobs or kind of rolled into one. Um, I'm very busy with my kids, um, with obligations and things I've committed to at my kids' school and at my church. And so um, this is not something that I just, I have nothing else to do. No, I want to do it and I make time to the to do it so much so that um, I'm pretty sure my family doesn't have clean clothes right now. Um, so I want to be able to really just help each other more. Um, if you guys have questions for me about specific ways and how I've sold things, please, please, please reach out to me. Um, I, I have no doubt like at all that if I can do this, Literally anyone can do it, okay? Comes down to confidence in yourself, confidence in the company, and we have each other. Like, we have the best resources right here. So let's be a team together, and if you have questions for me, go ahead and shoot. I'm happy to answer them. Um, thank you so much, ladies, for your hard work, for um, everything. You're just... You're rock stars. I've seen so many of you grow, and um, I just am honored and love being your leader. And I can't wait to see you hit those um, promotions, hit those milestones in your sales. It's just so exciting to be in business with you ladies. So thank you so much.